Good morning. Welcome to Pastor John's Fireside Chat. It is Wednesday, April 14th. I hope that you're doing well. For the last hour and a half, I have been listening to our DCE, or one of our DCEs, Chase Drake, lead the children of our Mother's Day Out program in a devotion. And he's been singing, Jesus loves me, this I know. And after about 15 minutes, you get kind of tired of hearing it, to be honest with you. But I've listened to it for the last hour and a half. And the more I heard it, the more it made me ponder that last verse of the song. You know how it goes. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. I just started pondering Who's the they? Is it just the little children? Well, obviously not. Little children are weak. And Jesus is strong for them. But they're not the only ones that are weak. We all are weak because of sin. We're not the people we have been created to be. We fall far short of all that we could be, what we should be. And yet, it's because of our need that Jesus came into this world. He understands that we're weak, and there is incredible freedom in being honest with God and honest with ourselves. I don't have to be super husband. I don't have to be super dad. I don't have to be super grandpa or super pastor. I can just be honest and say, I'm John. I'm a sinner. I am weak, but I have a relationship with the God of the universe who is strong, who is loving, who cares for me and blesses me. And that I have the privilege of not only having a relationship with the God of the universe, but I have that double portion of grace, you could say, of being able to receive his love and to share it wherever I go. And that's really what the Christian life is all about, is having a relationship with the one who is strong, who gives us his strength, and his love and his forgiveness so that we can freely share it wherever we go. And through that process, the kingdom of God is advanced in this world. Or as Jesus taught us to pray in the Lord's Prayer, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Every time we receive God's love and share it, the kingdom of God is coming here on earth as it is in heaven. And that's what changes people's lives. Your life has been changed because the kingdom of God came to you. The God who is strong came to the one who is weak to bless you with life eternal. And I pray that you will receive that blessing joyfully, but then also share it with others so that more and more people might understand that they are weak, but we have a relationship with a God who is strong. Have a great day in the Lord.